what's up in this video i'm doing a really cute french tip so i'm going to start with some alcohol i already have my nails shaped we're just going to spray some alcohol and i'm going to use a little brush to clean off any dust that is left on here I'm going to use this Legacy Nails white gel polish to create the French tip. This is the liner brush that I'm going to be using for the French tip. This is from Amazon. This is the number one brush from this kit. <laughs> if you are interested in getting this brush, you can find it in my Amazon storefront. Just follow the link in the description. Let's get started with French. Okay, so before I begin, I just want to mention I have my fan on. So that is what you are listening to. If you can hear some noise. So I'm just going to load up my brush here with some of the gel polish. And what I mean by that is just making sure all the bristles are covered. But you can see there's not too much on the brush itself. It's just um nice and a nice thick coating of it i'm starting with my nails nice and filed i'm not adding any base coat or anything i think i'll be fine without it so i start from one end of the nail and then go to the other end because we're gonna do a rounded nail so let me put my foot in the view here so this is what the nails are gonna look like so if you can see, they're like rounded. So um, yeah, that is what we're gonna be creating. So now I'm just going to fill in this little empty space here that I already created. So I just create the outline on the bottom and then you just fill it in and make sure that all the sides are covered and that it's evenly pigmented throughout.
now I'm going to use my favorite top coat, which is the Young Nails Stain Resistant Top Coat. And let's see what our toes are looking like. Yes, let's top coat them. Now I'm going to add on these little rhinestones with the Valentino Diamond Gel and these are the biggest size. These are the ones I have on my fingers. But yeah, super cute. Let's add on these rhinestones. So now I'm going to add the little rhinestones and I always start on the center for some reason and then work my way outwards. I think that way I can just like um, make sure that it's even like there's wood on each side and it's not like a like an odd number i guess maybe and just doing one side at a time and we are going to fit one more you can see i'm just like smushing it into the gel And it really just sinks into it. Cute. Let's get her into the light. Okay, now I'm just going to... Look how cute that looks. Now I'm just going to add some oil. And we are done. 